Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, first one, let's select this background and lock layer, select this sky, also lock layer, select this build layers, let's right mouse, precoms, add name, builds. Click OK. Then select this reflection and glass. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, glass. Click OK. Select this mirror left and right. Let's link to body. And select this object. Let's see. OK. Select this body. Let's link to object. And select this left wheel and right wheel. Okay, let's go to solo. Okay, so let's select this left wheel, go to solo and go to pen tool. Let's make one line. Okay, clear session two, go to fill, select this known for close inside color, click OK and go to stroke, chain stroke with five. Nice, so select shape layer. Go to stroke and let's change stroke color like this. Click OK. OK, we can change with a little bit, for example, 7. Nice. So select the shape layer and go to add. Go to trim pads. Open trim pads 1 here. Change end 0. Make end shape frame and go to some shape frames change and 100 let's see okay so let's move to left a little bit okay go to here and in this time let's make start tree frame go to here and change start 100 select tree frames make easy let's see nice so select the shape layer one and go to pen tool Select this point, hold shift, move it down. Clear session tool, let's see. Very good. So go to here and I want to make this part to smooth. Let's open shape one, stroke, and change butt cup to round cup. Very nice. Then select the shape layer and control D for duplicate, move to right. And let's move to here. Let's see. Nice. Let's move to up a little bit. Okay, let's select the shape layer. One, press U, go to last shape frame, and go to edit, split layer, or control shift D, delete. Select layer two, press U for C shape frames, go to last shape frame, and again make some one, edit, split layer. And delete. Close shape frame settings. Let's control D for duplicate again. And let's move to right. And move to right this layer. Nice. Let's move to left this layer. Okay, very good. So go to last shape frame and select these shape layers. And let's right mouse, precoms, add name, wheel, lines. Click OK. Let's see. Nice. And right now, let's control D for duplicate, move to right. Again, control D, move to right. Again. Let's see. OK, let's make more compensation for loop animation. Okay, nice. Let's select work area 9 seconds and right mouse, trip com to work area and select these wheel lines, compensations. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, lines, wheel. And let's name left. Click OK. So let's unsolo and let's see. Nice. Select this line, left wheel. 
Move to down here. Okay, very nice. Let's move it up a little bit. So right now, let's control D for duplicate, move it down here. And move to right this composition. Let's see. Very nice. So let's select this line wheel left, change name right, and let's link to wheel right. Select wheel right, let's see. Nice. And select left, link to left wheel. Okay, so select these left and right wheels. Let's link to object. Select object, let's see. Nice. Select this glass, let's link to car body. Let's select object again. Okay, nice. So let's open composition glass. And select reflection. Let's move to here. Go to first second. Let's press P. Make new passing keyframe. Go to some keyframes. Move to right. Go to first second. Let's move to here. Say keyframes. Make easy or F9. Let's see. Okay. Go to here. Select this reflection. Go to edit, split layer, delete. And select this glass. Let's control D. Move to up, select reflection, go to click toggle switch mode, change non to alpha matte 2. Let's see. Nice. Right now we can move reflection object inside glass layer. So let's select this layer glass, go to here, and edit split layer, delete. Then select this all layers, right mouse, precoms. Add name, reflection. Click OK. And let's duplicate this composition. Let's Control D, move to right, and let's make more compositions. Okay, nice loop animation. Let's close composition and let's see here. Okay, that's good. So right now we can make car animation. Select this object. Let's press P and move to here and move to right. Let's make new passing keyframe. Go to one second and move to left. Let's select keyframes, make easy. Let's animation. Okay, and go to graph editor. Select this graph. Let's make graph like this. Okay, back to keyframes and select this body. Let's go to solo and select palm behind. Move the anchor point down. Clearization tool and unsolo. Select body, press R and let's chain rotation like this. Okay. Let's change minus six and make rotation keyframe. Go to here change rotation 3 and go to some keyframes change minus 1 that 5 and go to some keyframes change 0 select rotation keyframes make easy let's see nice select the rotation keyframes move to left okay that's good Okay, so right now let's select this object and make new passing keyframe. Go to here and move to right. Select these keyframes, go to graph editor and let's say animation. Okay, select this graph, move to right. And this move to right. Nice. Back to keyframes, let's see timing. Okay, select this last keyframe, move to left. Okay, let's move right a little bit. And right now, let's make rotation keyframe for body. And go to here, chain rotation 6 or 5. A chain 6. And let's select this left wheel. Let's move to right. 
and right wheel move the inside like this let's see okay then go to 10 frame click here right plus 10 click ok and change rotation minus 3 go to 10 frame again for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down any keyboard and change this one go to 10 frame change 0 let's see Okay, what problem with keyframes? Let's select this last keyframe for object. Let's move to right. Nice. And select these rotation keyframes. Last four keyframes. Move to left. Okay, let's select these keyframes. Move to right. Let's see. Okay, that's good. We can move to right a little bit for a better result. Okay, let's select three frames. Go to graph editor. And let's try make three frames like this. Okay, back to three frames and Select these rotation keyframes, move to here. Okay, that's good. So select keyframes and let's move right. Okay, so right now let's make new object keyframe. Go to here and move to left again. Okay, and right now, let's make new rotation for body. Go to here, chain rotation minus 6, and go to 10 keyframe, chain 3, go 10 keyframe, change minus 1, that 5, go 10 keyframe, chain 0. Let's say again. Okay. So, Let's select last keyframe, delete, and select these rotation keyframes, move to here, and this position, move to right. Okay, very nice. Nice. So, let's create road line. Let's go to pen tool, and let's make line like this. Clearization tool, go to stroke color, change white, and stroke width, change like this. And let's open inside, contents, shape 1, and stroke 1. Let's click this plus icon for open dashes, and change dash like this. Okay, nice. And let's make offset keyframe, go to here. And change this 100. Okay, this way is slow. Let's change minus 1000. I want more speed. Let's change minus 4000. Okay, that's good. So, let's select the shape layer, change name Rod Lion. And move to behind here. Let's see. Nice. So, let's select these builds and press P, make new passing keyframe. Go to last second and move to down like this. And select these builds. Let's unlock all these background layers. And select this background. Let's press P, move to down like this. Okay, and let's move to up here. Okay, let's see. Nice. So, don't forget to select this body and let's press P. Go to here and make new passing tree frame. Go to three tree frame, one, two, three. Let's move to down car body. Go to three tree frame again, one, two, three. Select first tree frame, copy past. 
and select keyframes make easy then let's hold alt click this time icon go to play button property and loop out duration for done expression click this empty area let's see okay this is very fast let's select these three keyframes hold alt move to right for slow animation let's see okay that's good we can change more speed let's hold alt move to left for 2k frame let's see okay that's good so friends thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck